Uh, I'm gonna do two videos tonight. Um, this is about Sister Sister Magazine filed for bankruptcy, and I was a multi-year subscriber of the magazine. Um, you know, definitely I seen. Um, just reading something on somebody's site saying something about. 2000 as June 2013 she had 135,000 subscribers which isn't a lot especially for the cost of print and you know she had an interesting magazine because I used to definitely read them that was like my attic there it was like my nerve calm occupied mine but I have not been able to do that in so many years um so definitely, um, the, uh, you know, but with the advertising, I don't know how much, I, I knew it was kind of pricey. I called, well, it was about seven or eight years ago. I called, I tried to see maybe they had some independent opportunities, something I could get into the, contribution or something like that. But this is what I have a question I have to ask about all of these businesses. I hate it when Honey Magazine went out of business. I hate it because I love that magazine. It was just so good. I don't even know who was the person of Honey Magazine, but whoever it was, they need to come on a talk show. They need to have a YouTube channel, something. Even if it's called formerly Honey Magazine. I love that magazine. I remember they had Andre 2000, TLC, and they had the most beautiful photography art. Whoever was a photographer, oh my goodness. I don't know who it was, but they sure don't have any credits on nobody I know today. I haven't seen anything similar. Um, this is, you know, kind of unfortunate because, you know, reading stuff on after a while, because there's so much stuff to read online and stuff like that, you know, it's just so much to read and then there's people that don't read so that's all the factors that play into about the magazines I mean when you're on long rides I mean that definitely should be the promo going but when you try to reach out to these companies when you're having something going to cross reference and also support you as a black business a lot of them they don't reach out they want to just do celebrities and stick within that network when you should have a backup network along with your celebrity network not just your family your celebrity but also regular everyday people sometimes you know even if you just sample them into a, a, another division of what you're already doing or get them interested into a um get them interested into a um, another company or a network company because it's like with all these magazines like Jet, Ebony, they were connected together and every time we get have a magazine it always has to go out of business or get bought out and that has to stop. I blame the people that aren't doing anything, blame the people that only care about themselves they only take interest in something if it has the celebrity everybody care about right? they just don't have their own personality you know so now you uh, it's going to be sister sister brought out pretty much similar to Carol's daughter what I'm going to uh, definitely do a video about on it um, this is ridiculous, like, now the only black-owned magazine we have, and you know, when they had that homosexual couple on their, um, cover, it's like, oh gosh, we see where this is going, it's about to be corporate on, and so, but then we get this news that sister sister is filing for bankruptcy, um, and so, nowhere that goes, just a repeat history, when we learn, um, so definitely, this is a great time if you are a media, independent black media, where you definitely get your opportunity to be out, be a media support sponsor. 
um, that's when we have to work stronger and it's a lot of work, okay? It's a lot of work. It's nothing where you're going to 8 to 4, not an 8 to 12. It's a lot of work. But it's the masses, because the masses need these services. The masses are the ones that are complaining, but you only have the minute out there being active on the forefront. We cannot expect the same people to always be doing stuff. We have to get there and do better than what we're doing. This is ridiculous. I mean, in one week, two name brand companies that we know about, Okay, this doesn't count the ones that has not made the major headlines or came across my attention or anyone I know or than someone else's attention. This is two major companies, black, that start off black owned between bankruptcy and bought out, sold out. So when they buy you out, um, they may give you a royalty or treat, you know, cheat your royalties or put your stuff on extreme clearance and then they wage your product out. Look what and then look what Dre did with Beats. They closed this company out after he sold it to him. So why you just did not let them rent it for you like they always doing us. But, you know, that comes with people not taking life serious. I do not I don't People that don't take life serious, that want to play this old forgiveness and giving kind of stuff, detour away from me ASAP. Um, you, you just are a hindrance and a cripple to any progression. Um, you know, you are a support of the current system. You need to stop fooling yourself. You, you really do that you're trying to make the world a better place because you're not. You're not trying to make the world a better place. You're not trying to make yourself a better person. Um, these people that get there and they, they sociopaths. And they'll be the same ones getting out support and they see all this stuff they're going, but they're not taking any active part in making sure we keep our stuff like right. What is the next... Um, You know, magazine. We have to get there and support the magazine. You know, I, you know, if there's an interesting story with the final car and I see the cover, I will buy it. You know, they had my Angelo on there. And I don't have, you know, I collect stuff I don't have time to read. I just really don't. I may browse it or need to read it two or three times. <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. I just like life is just so serious. Um, then there's another headline about um the fed the feds and got there and they didn't stop printing money. Um, a lot of people are not taking life serious. That's all I gotta say. You're not taking life serious. Um, you know, stop fooling yourself. Stop going Sunday morning. You learn about Noah. All these people uh, from supposedly when the earth started or whatever like that. But you don't even know people within the last century. You don't even know your own recognizable people within your own area. Black people in your area. People that have came um, in slavery and being entrepreneurs. Um, being economists and um, being educators, you don't know them. You only know Harriet Tubman, um, Mary Bethune because they're a school and it's up in Alabama and it's totally told to you. You only know a few options in life and that's uh, very sad. You know, it's beyond sad and um, definitely you're following all this style and then when times get hard, you want people to hurry up and rebrush you with some what to do you know and that's draining um and uh definitely with the magazine we'll see where this here goes 
in the next two years. Hopefully it doesn't have to dissolve. Um, but, you know, the, the, ink, the ink that wrote itself, it didn't dry itself. It didn't dehydrate it now. And definitely, the reply of a solution. I'm definitely having the format of those that have your magazines to reach out and reach out. You have to reach out. This is not something where, okay, you think you put it on the shelf or you're writing the ink and Ghostwriter, like the show that used to come back out. That was one of my favorite shows. And it's going to go in the air and people's going to start buying it. No, you have to put the promotion in. You can't just be one of the most with celebrity. You can't do that. Because celebrities want you to highly promote them. And so definitely. I'm interested in people that have interview maps. I'm supposed to be in the, well, say the black parent. You know, this is all in with salute with the vendors, the supporters, everyone else to be in the Fusion magazine. Um, so I definitely, you know, I don't know if I'm prematurely announcing it, but just an estimate. Um, and you also can go to our Pinterest board and, you know, see some stuff. Um, definitely a great, you know, great for our community to study. Um, so, definitely, everybody else studying you, but are you studying you? That's the question to ask yourself.